Well, tonight we're just going to kind of stroll down uh, memory lane and uh, just kind of look, take a look back at uh, some of the things that uh, from the past and from the present and, of course, the future. And that's why tonight we've got the Kings of Disco um, here. And we're going to just kind of talk about some things and see what their perspective is on some of the things that they've been, where they're going to be in the future, and, uh, you know, where this uh, pandemic is going to take everybody once we're done. So I kind of want to go a little old school back to the uh, early days, and I'm going to kind of put uh, <clears throat> Ray and uh, Alex on the spot because uh, there was an album early on that you guys did, and uh, I have it here. You can see it over my shoulder. It was <laughs> 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 yeah what the heck was going on back in those days when when they were that? and uh you know it, it's one of those things where you scratch your head and, and you know being a fan you know i've got these kind of things but ray i mean when you guys were living in it and you and alex were a part of it i mean what the heck was going on well we're sort of uh used to dressing up but that was taking it a bit too far uh it's funny when you have to get your face uh painted every night before a show. So that was interesting in itself because I wasn't ready for all of that. But uh, the costumes were actually nice to wear and uh, they were a little hard to dance in, but it was an interesting uh, album and uh, it wasn't very successful, but it was, uh, that's what you do when the producers tell you to do something and you know, you might have your reservations about it, but you kind of go with the flow and see what happens. And uh, it seems that the people really enjoy our original costumes a bit more. So, <laughs> and and we talk about you know what this look was that they were trying to go for, but um, I've got to ask you, Alex. I mean, what in the heck was going on, especially for little kids that saw you guys dressed up in the you know you looked like a deck of cards. Unfortunately, <laughs> I, unfortunately, I scared a lot of people <laughs> because. It, makeup sort of evolved into a lot of different looks and it's thanks to our producers who decided to bring in makeup artists and experiment on it. and we happened to be doing an interview one day and this little girl came up to us and she looked at us all of us and then she looked at me and at the time I had gold in my nose, in my nose. <laughs> well she started to cry she whimpered she went oh she was a mess she was a mess <laughs> i'm really sorry <laughs> didn't plan on that but we had it we enjoyed it a bit it was a moment where we had to 